on your second video in a row, but you would never know. Welcome to this very special edition of T-Shirt Tuesday number three. Number four. I don't remember. One of those. Somebody requested for us to show them the stickers on our computers. Mm -hmm. This is mine. And I just have the MacBook Pro and then I have a monogram sticker right there and pink and then the font is interlocked because I think the circle monogram just looks weird. I wear the same color. It's okay. And then I have this kind of like mint green turquoise case on the top, not the bottom because it cracked off. <laughs> and the top is cracked too. But I just have like a Vineyard Vine sticker on it and then this Southern Tide sticker and a frat collection one. And I think it's very cute and I love personalizing my computer with Lily Pulitzer wallpapers and such. Okay, so my turn. I have also the MacBook Pro and I have a hot pink case on it and a lot more stickers. Okay, so on the outside I have frat collection. I can't even see. Okay, Southern Marsh, uh, Vineyard Vines, Southern Tide, Southern Proper, over under and another southern prop. On the inside, I have a Lily Flitzer monogram wallpaper with this gorgeous shirt on keyboard, which I got off Amazon.com. And then, yeah, I'm, 99 cents. Not really. Oh, then I got. Yours was 99 cents? Yeah. And it was like 10 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so then I have this um, monogram in pink and this little bow tie sticker from Southern Tiger. And that is my computer. Oh, God. We are doing the Winter Wonderland <laughs> tag today, so let's actually start the video. Uh huh. So number one, what do you Hold like? On, I'm gonna stick this down. I really don't need it until later on. What do you like best about winter? I love winter weather. I know a lot of people hate it. I do, and I love Christmas, obviously, and I love skiing. Mm -hmm. I love Christmas, and I like skiing too. I've only gone skiing once, but I've loved it so much, and I. Lara always talks about like skiing, and I'm like, oh, so jelly, so jelly. <laughs> but then I also like the weather too. Like mm -hmm. we both love winter weather, and everyone's like, you girls. And winter fashion. Mhm. Mm and then Christmas, obviously, and I love snow, and I like getting a two and a half week break. Mhm. Mm Number two, scarves or beanies? Obviously, scarves. Who would choose beanies? I mean, sorry if you're into that beanie life, but. <laughs> I love scarves. These are my favorite scarves. This one, this one, and this one. I have this one because I only brought two. These aren't really my favorites, but I just grabbed like the first ones I saw. And there's this one, and my mother picked this one up from Target. And it's actually from the dollar section. She was like, I got you a $2 scarf. I was like, okay, thanks. <laughs> Um, I like it because it's probably just because it's cheap and stuff, but I like how it's not like huge and fluffy. It's just like a lightweight scarf, just if you want to like accessorize but not like, die of heat. And this one is also from Target. I got this one in August, I think, and it is the like feed collection. And this one provides 14 meals for people, and it's got like the red stitching on the end and the tassels. And I think it is very pretty, and I love it, mm -hmm. and it's soft. So. Number three, what is your favorite holiday movie? Uh, I actually haven't watched this movie yet, but Elf. I love Elf and I need to go watch it and find it downstairs, oh, yeah. but I'm too lazy to do that. I also love Elf, but I really like um, A Wonderful Life. I just like love black and white movies and I our family- I hate black and white movies. Wow. Uh, well, our family watches it every holiday season and I love it so much. You know me, you know that I'm not a movie person, I yeah, can't her, focus for that. She has the attention life. span of a goldfish. Favorite winter nail polish. This is mine, and this is by Essie, and it's called Toggle to the Top. And I actually didn't really expect Toggle to like to this until I saw like a ton of Instagram pictures of it, and I was like, this looks nice. Because when I saw it, like in the store, it looks like it would be like really gaudy on your nails, because it's like a maroon polish with like maroon glitter. Gaudy. But... I thought it would look like that, but I'm actually wearing it on one of my nails right now, and I like how it looks. I think it's not too bold. It's just it reminds me of the holidays and Christmas and everything. Okay, so, so mine is an OPI polish, and it is in. I'm not really a waitress, and I got this last year. Really, ow. 
my Sorry I'm though. drinking so much stuff. Like, I'm sick. I don't know if you can tell my, my voice, but, like, I have to stay hydrated. Even yeah, if it I'm is like Dr. Pepper. Yeah, I'm to drink it a second. Okay, so, OPI, nail polish. I'm not really a waitress. And it's just, just this, like, red, holiday, shiny, pretty it has a lovely color. Tooth mark accent on the lid. Oh, yeah, because I can never get my nail polish open. Like, for instance, right now I can't get it open, so I have to, like, use my teeth sometimes, okay? I'm sorry. I know it's bad. Don't tell me that. I know. You, I can just see the comments. Here's back up. You're hurting your teeth. I know. Number five, what is your favorite Starbucks holiday drink? I'm dying of <coughs> heat in this room. Oh, you wearing spirit jersey. Okay, my favorite Starbucks holiday drink is either the salted caramel hot chocolate or, no, that's probably my favorite holiday Starbucks drink. My favorite is the, okay, it always takes me a while to remember. Like, I'm like, I want this, this, and then I get up and I'm like, can I have the, okay, it is the caramel brulee latte, and my favorite food or my favorite dessert, quite possibly my favorite food, is creme brulee. And so it has like the little crunchy bits. Like if you don't know what creme brulee is, it's like this really good custard. And then it has caramelized brown sugar on the top, which is crunchy. I just like eating that part and then I get the custard so to good. <laughs> And then, um, so it has like the crunchy pieces on the top and it tastes like caramel and sweet and creamy. Oh, it's so good. Next Number six, what are your top three winter essentials? First, I have to have some lotion because if you don't know me, I get like ashy knees. <laughs> I, I'm like a black person, I'm sorry, okay? And so I just really like this one. It's by Twilight, it's by Twilight Woods. It's by, it's by Bath and Body Works and it's in Twilight Woods and it's their Triple Moisture Body Cream. So it's, <laughs> it's oh triple the moisture. I love those. I actually have one of those too. So I got a thumb and knee travel size. I am struggling life. Okay, next one is a sweatshirt because I can't live without sweat sweat sweatshirts, <laughs> oversized t-shirts, really comfy, comfy, comfy leggings and all that stuff. So this is probably my favorite and most comfortable one. It's just this Patagonia and it's white and it's so it has soft. A hood on it. So fluffy. And I like hoods, don't judge me. I walk around my house wearing hoods. Not just the hoods, but like I put them on. I just put the hood on. <laughs> and lastly, I have my deck boots, which they're good for rain, snow, and everywhere in between. Ah, Mark. So buy yourself a pair now. www.llbean.com. They're $99. Yay. And um, I have a vest, because vest, <laughs> gotta be there. I have <laughs> a vest. Mm -mm. <laughs> this is just the navy. J. Crew um, excursion vest, and I love it. And I was wearing it. We both have this one, and I love it. And they're so warm and comfy. And then I also have this, and this is the Bath and Body Works holiday collection twisted peppermint. Um, I love this, and it's a lotion. So Christmasy, yeah, it's a lotion because I also get dry skin, so I put it on my hands or like my arms before I go to bed. Because I don't know about you, my elbows get so dry. And it hurts and it cracked. It's not good. I'm so exhausted. I don't know why. So my eyes go watering again. I don't know. And then, of course, you can't live without chapstick. I also love EOS, but this one is like, I think it works better for me. This is Burt's Bees Beeswax Bee, bee Balm. This is bee, Burt's Bees <laughs> Beeswax Lip Balm. And this one's like the pepperminty taste one. I also like the honey one. It tastes like honey. No cool. Question number seven. Name one item on your Christmas list this year. Logging on to my computer. Okay, you can go okay. first. So this is mine, and I'm in the Atlas, mother. If you're watching, and I love this. And this is off of Etsy. Actually, both of ours are from Etsy. And this is a monogrammed quarter zip and like oatmeal. And I like the regular like sweatshirt materials. But I love this one because it's like the Patagonia Better sweater one, but those are like really expensive. This one is $48, and I want this exact one with the circle monogram in brown. And this, in case you're wanting this, this is from the shop Elle's Briar Patch. So E L S Briar Patch. 
Okay, mine, I know I'm getting this for Christmas, but I'm gonna get it after Christmas because it's coming from China and it takes 12 to 15 days to ship. But, I know I'm getting this. See, I have a whole bunch of my Christmas wish list, but this is just one that I found. I'll show you. It's also from Etsy, and it is the Hot Trendy Purple Slash Green Slash Clear Colored Bubble Bib Enamel Disc Circle Crystal Necklace Statement Wedding Party Bridesmaid Necklace Christmas Gift. <laughs> Number eight favorite Christmas song. Hold on, let me just throw my computer on the floor. Hey. All I want for Christmas is you by Mariah Carey. <laughs> it's not you. You, you baby. All the lights are shining so brightly every She is messed up. <laughs> I like that one too. That's I'm just like. Mm. I also like the one. Um, I don't. I think it's called. Hand. I think it's just called Christmas. It's like Christmas. I'm like in this mood where I'm like really tired and then really hyper. Number nine. Are you going Black Friday shopping this year? Girl, we already went. Since it was like more than a month. Yeah. This was about half a month ago. Yeah, why did they ask you over Black Friday shopping? Because winter is you the 21st rant, of girlfriend. December. You go on a rant. Winter starts on the 21st of December. And we're filming this on the 21st of December. So it is Christmas. It is winter today. Happy winter, everyone. So all you people thinking that winter starts in November, you is wrong because it says right here. First day of winter, okay? Look on your calendars, people. You have your facts wrong. Just saying. Number 10, must have winter lip product. I have this one. And this is the Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Staining, the color Smitten. Got it. Did I get it on my nose? Yes. Just kidding. <laughs> Okay, so this one's Bitten Kissable Balm Stain in the color Smitten, and I love this one, and I've been wearing it a ton this month, but I think in general, just like any berry-colored um, lip product, oh, it's very so nice hard. for your fall. Then so I have this, and it is the Baby Lips in la, 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 Cherry Me, and it's because it like, has a like, really pretty like red color. And it was more strong, I think, and it smells really good at the same time. And I just really like baby lips, especially this one for the winter time. But today is winter, not yesterday, and it's today. I'm sorry. I really apologize in advance for my rants, but I'm just in a really weird mood today. Number eleven. Will you be rocking an ugly Christmas sweater this year? Duh. Of course I. Mine's in my closet. I don't know if you've already seen mine, but mine has cats and bells and bows and a wreath. Question number 12. Number 12. Have you ever had a white Christmas where you live? We, we had if one you count it, it was like a dusting. I but it was it. still white. I counted it. Yeah. It was 2011. Because we had a ton of snow that year. Like, we had like 10 snow days. It was awesome. Awesome. And then the past two years, we've had one. Actually, we, we got have one this last, year. Last year, we got Is a two-hour delay. You didn't, you didn't have a snow day at all last year? No, we had a two-hour delay. We were off for two days. Number 12. Favorite winter candle scent. Okay, I have two. <sighs> Mine, first one is Red Velvet Cupcake, which is burning in the background. And Vanilla Bean Noel, which I just finished burning like yesterday and I threw in the trash. This one I have is Bath & Body Works and it's called Fresh Balsam. And I know Laura hates it. Because she, she hates the smell of Christmas trees. But I love it because I love the smell of Christmas trees. And this, I think, is like the closest that I have come to actually like finding like something that smells like a real Christmas tree. So if you want one of that, hit up the Bath and Body Works. <laughs> I love it and it smells like Christmas to me. And if I hadn't left it at Laura's house, I would have been using it. And I seriously thought I lost it. I was like, how does somebody lose a candle? And then Laura's like, you left your candle at my house. I was like, oh, that's where it went. Yeah, we're those kind of people who bring candles to into this house. Well, we have to fill my candles. Okay, number 14, how will you be celebrating the holidays? Well, so on Christmas Eve, we're going to my aunt's house, and we're spending Christmas with them. Then we're coming back on Christmas, well, we're coming back at Christmas Eve, and then on Christmas, we're opening our presents and doing all that fun stuff, and then the next day, Boxing Day or Kwanzaa, 
you can call it either thing if you celebrate Kwanzaa, if you celebrate Boxing Day. I don't know what Boxing Day is. Boxing Day, okay, I know what this is. I looked it up. It is a Canadian holiday. Canadians, if you're watching, tell me if this is right. Where they give away, like, they, it's called Boxing Day, not like boxing, but like boxing, boxing like put stuff in a box. So basically, they just like give away their old stuff to charity. So I think America should do that because that's cool. Okay, anyways, on Boxing Day, Kwanzaa, or the day after Christmas, or 26th of December, we are packing all our stuff into a suitcase and taking it to the airport and hopping on a plane and flying across the country. I mean, across the ocean. To go to Switzerland. Yay! To go Switzerland. To Lucky her. Uh, I don't know, I've never gone away for the holidays or for Christmas. I need to stop saying the holidays. It's Christmas, I mean, I don't, you can celebrate holidays, but for me, Christmas because we are Christians and we celebrate Christmas. I think I should start celebrating Hanukkah, Christmas, and Kwanzaa. Kwanzaa? Kwanzaa? I don't really know what it is. I know people who celebrate Hanukkah and, and I know people who celebrate Christmas, but I don't know anyone who celebrates Kwanzaa. So if you celebrate Kwanzaa, tell me what it is because I really want to know because I don't remember back in seventh grade. But if you get presents, you should send me a Kwanzaa gift. <laughs> okay, um, for me, to that rant, <laughs> um, we don't really go out of town for Christmas, um, we like staying at home for Christmas because it's so warm, so pretty much, or actually, on Christmas Eve we go and we do the candlelight service at our church, and then on Christmas we just open our presents and then we go to... They don't wrap their presents. Thanks for watching, I hope you like, comment, and subscribe, and give us video suggestions In the comment section below. Bye! Bye!